I never wanted to be white because I grew up around white kids. Never wanted to be white. And right now, as soon as I said that, some people, I ain't never want to be white. Yeah, you did. We all naturally was like, man, white kids got it easy. Man, white kids don't get whoopings. They don't get, yeah, they do. They just don't get, white kids get punished just differently than us. That's why white people grow up different than us. Black parents threaten you for the moment. White parents say shit to stick to your spirit the rest of your life. <laughs> Look at the white over here. That's true. My mom, Elizabeth, was like, tell me when I'm lying. White, black parents be like, you touch something else, I'm going to beat your ass off. You be like, damn, bitch, we at the DMV. Like, what was that? <laughs> white parents say shit to make you be like, damn. But I wouldn't have known if I wasn't at Tanner House. I'm at Tanner House one day. He got in trouble. The school called or something. His dad was just snapping like, Tanner, I can't believe this, pal. <laughs> you know, they cuss you out, but they let you know they still like you. You know what? This is some real malarkey, buddy. <laughs> he said, I'm so goddamn disappointed in you. I just don't know what to do. This one, it got real. This one, I, I, just, I, I didn't know what to say. He was like, you know what, Tanner? I just, I just need a couple minutes away from you. He's like, you know what? I'm disappointed, but you know who else is disappointed? I bet your grandfather's probably turning over in his grave right now. <laughs> I said, damn. <laughs> you know how bad you gotta fuck up for somebody to turn over in their grave? <laughs> like, for real, what can you do for a motherfucker to be like, this motherfucker here. <laughs> this nigga showed him what a piece of us was This nigga here. <laughs> I started thinking about my granddaddy. He got a fucked up hip, so somebody got to go help him flip over. <laughs> Too much work. <laughs>